everybody welcome back to the channel I'm doing a solo survival adventure because I have a really big project that I want to work on and I want to bring you guys along with me to work on it but first I am going to add a name to this subscriber wall behind us the shout out wall back here behind me <laughs> and there are so many names on here <laughs> we're gonna run out of room or we're gonna have to like redo the signs in some way it's just not <laughs> It's getting kind of crazy, which is awesome. So my name for the wall is, now this is her Minecraft name, not her um, YouTube name, Puppy Alexa. Thank you so much, Puppy Alexa, for being one of my biggest fans and biggest supporters and for playing with me on Mindplex, and we have so much fun together. And I know you were or are wearing, oh, I don't have any food, wearing my skin, um, and I appreciate the uh, the gesture, but really, you know, I like it when people be themselves, too. It's cool to idolize somebody, but, you know, anyway, thank you for being my friend, Puppy Alexa. It's pretty awesome. So today... I am going to work on a really big project and something that I've been wanting to work on for a long time. I am going to build a greenhouse. <laughs> I want to build a greenhouse. And so the challenge to myself is, um, actually, I'm trying to figure out where I want to put it. I think I'm going to put it in my backyard. I really want to put it somewhere else in the town. I could put it like right here. I might put it up here in between. This is Lastic's house. And this is my house, of course. So I think I might put it where that like it's kind of sitting catty corner this way where the entrance is like right here and then I can do the stairs coming up this way to the greenhouse. Yeah, I think I like that. So um, my inspiration for the greenhouse is from the murder map grave gardens and they have the green greenhouse and it's made out of green clay. Hi, hey, chicken. And um, my challenge to myself, though, is to collect at least one of every flower in Minecraft to put in my greenhouse. At least one, if not more. So I already have a start. Here's roses. Let me see if I have any flowers. I'm going to need tons of sand, tons of clay, probably some dirt because not every flower can go in a flower pot. What do I even have? I need to organize my chest so bad. Okay. I'm going to need clay. I'm going to need sand. Oh, I don't have anything. <laughs> I don't have any flower. I have dye, but I, I want to make it dark green. So I'm going to need cactus. All right, I have cactus green. That's good. Um, I'm going to need lots of sand because I want to make green glass. So that's going to take even more green. Um, and I'm going to need uh, no clay, no sand, no green dye. Okay. And any flowers? Do you have any flowers in here? No. <laughs> okay, well, this is going to be a really big project. I'm going to try not to make as many cuts in this episode as I can. But, I mean, if I'm just running around looking for flowers and looking for things, like, um, it, I just don't want it to get boring for you guys. So, um, oh, there's seeds. All right, so I already have roses. You know what? Actually, if I have bone meal, I can breed, breed. I can breed these roses with bone meal. <laughs> Like I'm like I'm breeding cows. <laughs> like I'm gonna make more baby roses. And then there's these flowers that are at mid, so those need bone meal too. Oh, and she likes these blue flowers. I don't wanna take them from her. Maybe I can just borrow one like from the back. <laughs> this is Audrey's house. I'm gonna borrow one of your blue flowers. Thank you. <laughs> I'll pay you back. <laughs> the blue orchids and then a dandelion. Okay, we got that. Um, I'm not going to take this down because it's decorative from mid or it'll be like uneven. So let me go see if I can find some bone meal and let's see what else is in here. This is like the community general store market thing. Um, seeds, random, uh, one bone meal. <laughs> there's no meat in here. Gosh. Okay. Uh, there's a, I'll take these. There's a peony, a rose bush. An azure bluet. I have a dandelion. A daisy. Okay, so I need a sunflower. Um, and then I need all the tulips. <laughs> oh, man. It would be best if I could just find a flower biome. So maybe when I go out to try to get clay, 
that I can maybe um, go try to find a flower biome. Sorry, if you heard that, that was my phone ringing. <laughs> All right, let me go to sleep, and then we will continue our quest in the Minecraft morning. All right, good morning. Okay, I'm going to use this empty chest back here. Nope, this one back here. <laughs> this one's empty. I'm going to take one of these with me. And I'm going to put it over here where I'm going to place the greenhouse. And I'm going to use this as my materials chest for the greenhouse. I like just getting into vanilla Minecraft and just building. I mean, it's really more fun if you could go into creative. But um, this is a challenge. <laughs> you know, doing it like this in survival. I'm going to go ahead and get my armor on. Because we're going on an adventure. I know that there's... um. A swamp I think it's that way I think that's where we're gonna head because we need lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of clay and we need all the tulips and I think you can only get the tulips from a flower biome so we'll see what we can see <laughs> okay so I think the swamp is right over here I still need lots of cactus too I need the other kinds of flowers, and I'm just grabbing this sand. This shovel is really good. I found this shovel in the end, <laughs> in one of the end cities, in the chest. I have to, that auto jump just takes a little bit to getting used to. <laughs> I know you can turn it off. I mean, it's not bad. I just, it's like, whoa, I wasn't expecting to jump right there. <laughs> All right, let's go up here. Somebody's already, we came over that way. We're going this way. Someone was here because that bridge was built already, so I know that this place has been, uh, has been scoped out already, which is fine. I just hope there's some clay left for me to grab. almost found that hole. Tulips! <laughs> I almost fell in the hole. Getting so excited over tulips. Red and orange. I still need the white and the pink. And um, what else am I missing? Sunflowers. Need sunflowers too. <gasps> oh! Oh! Is this a flower biome? Oh, it's plains, but that's okay. Yay! Look, the tulips! <laughs> I was headed to the cactus over here. And I came across horses and tulips and all kinds of cool stuff. Yes, I really need sunflowers. Hi, horsey. I need sunflowers. Oh, here's a poppy. I need poppies. Okay. And, oh, lilacs. <gasps> yeah, I need lilacs too. Aw, oh, man. Okay. Well, we're almost there. Got lots of cactus. I'm so excited. Oh, there's a cave down there. I don't think I feel like going into a cave right now, though. Just going to collect this cactus. What? What? You look crazy. What? What? Oh, man. I don't know if I've ever seen the new zombie. <gasps> like, the sand people zombie thing. <laughs> that was so cool. <laughs>
since we have to cook all of this clay pretty much um, because the crafting recipe for color clay is to cook blocks of clay into hardened clay and then you color the hardened clay so it's colored you're coloring a red block basically I don't not gonna have nearly enough coal to do this <laughs> so I don't want to turn every single piece of this clay into a block I need a crafting table out here let me grab one really fast the crafting recipe for color clay is to take blocks of regular clay and cook them into hardened clay and then you dye the hardened clay um, I'm gonna start cooking some cactus too so let me split this up a little bit more and see what that gives us and if I remember correctly which I think I do <laughs> it's eight hardened clay around the outside of the crafting table and then you put the dye in the middle and you get eight color blocks okay so I laid out the basic outline of what I want the greenhouse to look like and I right clicked with my shovel to create these paths right here and what I'm thinking is like if you're in like a rustic kind of I don't know outdoor greenhouse <laughs> that this would be the paths where you walk and then the displays of the flowers will be on these parts uh, this dirt's not going to stay here. This dirt is just an outline, and this is going to be replaced with the glass and the clay. And most of that is done cooking. I do not have nearly enough <laughs> cactus green for what I want to do. <gasps> no, this is not going to be enough. Um, okay, so this should yield... Yes, eight. Oh, good. For one, one die does eight blocks cool 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 okay I was worried about that I couldn't remember how many it does and then I also want to make the glass green so I think I'm gonna need way more green then I think I want to turn it into panes wait oh like this six <gasps> yes okay <laughs> I was like wait it's not three it's six panes will be a better use of the resources I think oh cool okay let me get these cooking too so I can turn these into this now I left some of the clay as little clay balls because I want to make bricks with them and the bricks will make a flower pot so we could put the flowers in the flower pot and then the ones that don't I'm just gonna put them on a grass block um, probably on the inside <laughs> kind of see what the greenhouse my inspiration for the greenhouse is um, it's a smaller version of course than the one in the murder map but it's green and it's so pretty all right so a few finishing touches just to kind of see what it's gonna look like I'm gonna make the where did I put the little clay right here okay we're gonna make some flower pots and put a few flowers in there too. I'll have to finish this another time just because this has taken me a really long time. <laughs> I've actually been recording for like an hour. This is not an hour long episode, but I've been recording that long. Did I only make one? Oh no, I made two. Okay. Ooh, that looks nice. Let me do two more on this other side and see what they look like. Um, we can put now the big flowers like the peony and the roses, unless they changed it. 
I don't think that it's been updated. Yeah, it won't go in a flower pot. They're too big. So I'll probably just display that one, especially that one, because that's my favorite, the roses in the back like that. Um, so we'll put the smaller flowers in the flower pot. We'll do two just to kind of see what they look like. We'll do this one and that one. There we go. So now we have the beginnings of my greenhouse all set. So we learned how to make colored stained clay, colored stained glass, stained glass panes. We started the design of the greenhouse. Thanks you guys for watching. I had so much fun. I love just playing in regular vanilla survival sometimes. It's just really relaxing. It's neat to get back to originally what Minecraft has always been. So I hope you guys had as much fun watching this as I did playing it and we will see you next time. Bye.